le Stewart. Le. What's up, everyone? I am back. And as you can see, I have Panda Express. So let's walk you through the lineup. So, of course, I had to get the chow mein orange chicken and the broccoli beef. It's a pretty classic combination. That's what I usually get. Over on table number two, gotta mix it up, get some fried rice, the Beijing beef, and the Shanghai Angus beef. And the associate decided to give me two forks because they thought it was for two people. But nah, it's not, man. Yes. Tiny spicy, a little sweet. The meat is chewy, that's good. I like it. I like it, I like it. <coughs> Some of the rice went down my throat. <laughs> Angus beef. The orange chicken, the staple of Panda Express. Here we go. Of course, let's take a look at this beef. Yeah, 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 yeah. In a big mushroom. I really recommend the Angus beef. I'm really glad I got to try it today. Imagine if Panda Express actually served pandas. I wonder if a panda tastes like chicken. When I eat Panda Express, it reminds me of my childhood because back in the day when I was a kid, they were only available at malls. So it, it reminds me of times when my mom would take me and my younger brother to the mall and uh, we would have Panda Express or some other uh, court food. One thing that I didn't like about going out to eat with my mom was that she would never let me and my brother order like soft drinks or anything sweet. We'd always have to get water with our meals, which kind of sucked. <laughs> my first question that I received on my last video was from Big Panda 148 shout out to you, Kenny. And he asked, so I'm your biggest friend? Yes, you are. You're my biggest friend. Fortune cookie one. Crack. This describes my life perfectly. Fortune number two. A long time admirer thinks highly of you. Thank you, whoever you are out there. Again, thank you guys for watching. Rate, comment your suggestions below, and subscribe for more videos just like this one.